Every year, members of the Greek community come together as one to hold Greek Week, a week-long event packed with activities and competitions that let fraternities and sororities show students at UT what Greek life is all about and why it is important to the university. It's good to um, just allow people to understand the, uh, the importance of your community, how big it is, and how uh, it's, good, it's good advertising for different organizations. I think it shows that we can all be united. We're helping out Habitat for Humanity. All the proceeds from Greek Week go to them. So it shows that we're more than just social functions. We're community service. So I just think it shows that we can all come together. Awesome. I think it gives a good, all the chapters a great opportunity to come together and all have fun. Throughout the week, members of sororities and fraternities are placing their loose change and extra cash into these buckets. The money will be then given to Habitat for Humanity. The Greek community is hoping to help build a house. Not only do they use this week for a good cause, but also for a little friendly competition. Several contenders go head to head to be crowned this year's Greek God and Goddess. Numerous events were set up for the participants as opportunities to earn points which ultimately determine the winner. One such event is the bucket competition. Everyone represents a competitor and is decorated with their picture. The more money they earn, the more points are added to their final score. But not every event is so easy. Day 1. The Greek Olympics. The Greek Olympics consisted of the lightning bolt throw, who members threw lightning bolts for distance. The relay race, full of obstacles. The game of twister. The torchbearer run around Frat Row. And the trivia bowl where contenders' knowledge of UT was tested. On day two, women and men strutted their stuff in the Panhellenic fashion show, modeling clothes from various stores in Knoxville. Greek gods and goddesses also showed off in their togas and demonstrated their talents in the karaoke contest. On day three, the Greek community showed their UT spirit by having a tailgate in Circle Park before the Florida UT basketball game. Not only was there pizza and coke, the skit round that theme was beating Florida. There also was a relay race. On day four, everyone piled into Thompson Bowling for a speaker. Bruce Pearl could not attend but sent a video message instead. Members of the basketball team, Dane Bradshaw and Chris Lofton, gave words of wisdom as well as football coach, Trooper Taylor. By the end of the week, the Greek community had reached their goals, not only having fun, but raising nearly $10,000 for Habitat for Humanity. So now you know what Greek Week is all about, but how much do you know about the Greek community itself? Panhellenic advisor Megan Fields tells us about the importance of Greek life and how it relates to this week of activities. First of all, it's a large percentage of the campus membership, approximately 15%, so that's a big portion of the students. And since so many students are involved, they're gonna have an impact. When students want to do something that promotes our core ideology, which is to promote the positive, develop women, and create an environment of unity and fairness, we want to go ahead and let them do that. Students learn by creating events, so that is why it's important uh, to have a week of Greek events. We make sure that there is an event that promotes each of our four pillars, which are scholarship, leadership, service, and sisterhood. So we make sure that within Greek week, each day has some kind of activity that fits into one of those things. And what do the Greeks themselves have to say? We do work together and that we are one big team and one big community and that we work towards other stuff, not just within our chapter, but like we did raising money for Habitat. Well, first of all, it's a really great way to get um, the Greek community out there to um, the university and show it in a positive way. I, you know, we kind of feel like anytime the Greek community is portrayed, you know, in the media or anything, it's always negative. So Greek Week is a really great way to get positive um, PR out there for um, the Greek community. Also, it's a great way to get all the chapters in Pentelenic plus all the chapters in IFC together for one cause. Um, we don't get to do that a lot, so we're really trying to work on that. There it is. Greek Week acts as a major fundraiser, but is also an enriching learning experience as well as a way for UT students to catch a glimpse of what the Greek community is all about. I'm Erin Olinger, and that's All About the Orange.